Alrighty, in this video I'm going to show you how you can add or remove users uh, so if you want to grant somebody permissions or remove somebody um, this is how you can do it so from the main page of your SharePoint site click on the gear icon on the top right and go down to site settings and when this page loads you want to click on site permissions and on here um, might look different than this one uh, but you'll have a members group an owners group and a visitors uh, if you want to have anybody that uh, if you want to give anybody read access only you'll put them in the visitors group if you want to have somebody that has full control you put them in the owners group or if you want anybody that uh, to have edit rights but not necessarily full control uh, you want to put them in the members group so I'm just gonna click on owners group and all these uh, you can pretty much that the steps are going to be the same no matter which group you pick uh, you want to go to new and here you can enter the personnel number if you happen to know it or you can just start typing uh, their last name uh, it'll automatically populate in uh, with uh, Active Directory uh, so on here I'm just going to select Michael Adani and you want to click show options before clicking on share uh, it's up to you if you want to send an email invitation um, but in this case I'm just gonna uncheck it and you want to click on share so when you click on share now you'll see that the user's been added uh, so let's say if uh, you wanted to remove users uh, you would do the same steps you will click on the gear icon select site settings site permissions and uh, obviously click on the group and uh, I'm just going to remove Adani so click on the check mark and you want to go to action and then click on remove users from group you gotta have, you're gonna get a little pop-up asking you, are you sure you want to remove them click yes and now Adani has been removed 